Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to type any of the 3D text for your iCron 7 in just one minute. You, you are going to use the Autodesk Maya and this is the fastest way to create any of the 3D text just by type in, then you can import into iCron 7 by using the FBX file exported from Maya. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step First, you open the Autodesk Maya, and then, as demo, I'm going to clear the iClone file. I'm not going to save this. Alright, next, in your iClone, in your Autodesk Maya, you should be able to see this, the curve. This is under the modeling. You have rigging, you have modeling. It is under the modeling. Then you go to poly modeling and click here. This is to create a 3D text in the grid. Once you click here, then you can type this. For example, I type in some of the text here. Alright, once, once I type here already, you can see it generates the text immediately. And of course, I can just mix with some of the foreign language. Alright, so now you can see this is the alignment. I can let it to align at the center. It is up to you. You can align at the right hand side or left hand side. Now this is already become the 3D text. And I also can change. So I, I redo again, just create it. I type it here. All right. So I can let it center align and I can change change the font font style as well can be any font style. For example, for this foreign language, I can change it to any font style. There's a K, the Kai T, this one. And now this is it italic. Of course, I, I can just make it without any of the italic. Right, once I feel satisfied already, I have to export it out. So from here, if you export it out as FBX, you click export the selections, you click export all. Right, as demo, I will export it as FBX file. So here I will choose the FBX. Now I, I will just save it on my desktop as demo. The file name, I will put it as text01. Right, I, I click export all. Once I click export all, when I double click, you can see it have some errors. So I not recommend to export it as FBX. Even if you drag into your iClone, it will have some errors here. Now you can see it has some of the meshes arrow. We are going to fix this. So we, we don't want to, to directly export it as the FBX file. First, I'm going to export it as, as the DAE. You start from the DAE. We don't choose the FBX. We choose the DAE FBX exportion. And then I export it on my desktop. The file name, I will just name it as text 02. All right, I export it as DAE file. Once you already get the DAE file, next, you open your Blender. Blender is a free software where you can just go and download it for free. Open the Blender. From the Blender, you import the DAE 
but before that you need to select the camera, the cube and the light. You press delete button to delete everything and click file import DAE from the desktop, the text 02 DAE. Once you already import it, it will appear opacity 0 and transparent but it, it doesn't matter, you just export it again, click file export as FBX from the blender. And then from the blender, you export it as FBX file, I export it on my desktop and I will just name it as text 02. For this time, it is really an FBX file. And then in your iClone, I don't want this already here, I, I will just start a new project. So use Ctrl A, you will know that this is the origin. You can drag into the icon 7, the text 02 FBX. I drag in. Next, you can see it is totally transparent. You just need to go to the UV, the material. You drag it down, you can see the opacity is 0. You just drag it. Now it already has the full opacity. And then you can change the text color as well. Just change the diffuse color. You can change the text color to make it become any of the, the coloring text, the colorful text. You can see I can just make it deeper. This is really a text, a 3D text. I can change, change the color as well. This is the, the auxiliary light. And now you can save it as a prop. Of course, you can just come to here first. And then you change the, the pivot to the bottom or you can put it at the center. It is up to you. And now I want to save it as a prop. Just go to here. Click the custom. Click the prop. Then you click plus. You save a new prop. Now this is a text 02. Enter. Now once you really save this as a, a new prop, you can use it whenever you want. This is really a new prop. If you want to share, you just right click here, find file. And then it will automatically open in Explorer. This is icon prop file, the text 02. You can share with your friends if you want. It is really easy just to type in from the Maya. You type in, it generates the 3D text automatically. Alright, that's all for today about how to type any of the 3D text in Autodesk Maya and import into your Icron 7 3.9 as an FBX file. You need the Blender to help you to convert the DAE file first before you import into the Icron 3. Point, before you import into Icron 7.9. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy happy animation and game developing. See you.